Maybe you could just say that. We're roughly about 10 days away from Christmas Eve and 11 days from Christmas Day. With that being said, uh, everybody's going to be looking to put up some last minute Christmas decorations. Uh, and for some, you know, they may not have the Christmas decorations, so they want to go out and buy it. Now, here are some cheap ideas. Now, please note this. I am not saying that, you know, all these are going to be the same price. Some of them are going to be higher. Some of them are going to be lower. Uh, but this is going to be around... Now the next thing will be, um, I'm not, I'm also not guaranteeing these are going to be in stores right now because Christmas stuff is selling rather fast. So let's begin. Now, if you just want uh, lights, now it depends on the type of lights you want. Do you want LED or do you want regular? Now, depending on that, uh, your best and you want them cheap. Now, your best choices will probably be Walmart or um, Walmart because they're around $2 or something like that. Uh, a box. Um, now, one box has is 23 feet. Uh, now, icicle lights are about 23 to 29 feet. Uh, they do have them in clear. Uh, multi, red, and blue. Uh, so it depends on what you want to do with that. Now, also, I do another thing you can do is depending on something is um, if if your Walmart will carry them too. Is after Christmas, um, you can pick up some of those red icicle lights uh, and use them for Halloween. Um, as maybe a backdrop or something, uh, just as an idea. Now, the next thing is uh, yard stuff. Now, it depends on the area you're in because not all areas are the same, and it depends on where you live. Now, the reason why I say that is is because where some people live in HOAs um, or homeowners associations. So, they have limits on what you can and cannot do or set up in, in your yard. So, find out from the, your homeowners association what you can and cannot do. Um, now, assuming you can do these, one of the good things are icicle lights, or inflatables, I'm sorry, inflatables. Uh, because they're quick, they're easy, and they can get the job done in a short time frame. Um, next thing is um, icicle lights, like I said. Um, now, also another good thing is if, if you want to kind of do garland and lights at the same time without paying for both, you can also get pre-lit garland. Now, um, those get around 20 to 25 feet or so. Uh, you can get them in, I've seen them in uh, clear, multi, and twinkling. Um, I haven't seen any twinkling this year for garland, so uh, I've seen them in multi and clear. Um, so there's that. Now, the last thing is this, um, trees. Now, one, unfortunately, Christmas trees are one of the biggest expenses uh, during Christmas season. Because depending on the size you want and if it's pre-lit or not, uh, those are going to vary the price a little bit as well as if it's regular lights or LED lights. Now... With it getting closer to Christmas, a lot of these stores like Walmart, Big Lots, Home Depot, 
flows, et cetera. Um, are wanting to sell their uh, display trees. So, um, fine if you see a display tree that you like, and you know it's, and you find out it's the last one in stock. Uh, see what they can do with that because I'm not, because each store is going to have their own policy when it comes to that sort of thing. Um, some stores are going to be like, okay, we can give it to you for 50% off or something like that, especially if there's lights out on the tree. Now, if there are lights out on the tree, um, unfortunately, you're going to have to put more to put on top. So do what you can with that. Um, now, the lights that you buy to put on them, they don't exactly have to be the same type, but get at least the same color or multicolor or whatever. Uh, now, they may not be able to, you know, chase and do this other nonsense like some trees do, but at least you will have trees that have lights on it. Now, uh, you can get chasing lights as well uh, that are LED. Uh, you, the good place to get them is Walmart. Uh, they are like, I'm, I'm not entirely sure how much they are, but they, they are fairly long. So it's up to you and how you want to do something like that. Um, now, the other bad thing with some of this is, is because we are getting into the later part of December, the weather is going to keep changing a lot. Like tomorrow, it's, or today, it's supposed to hit 60. Then it's supposed to cool down after that. So unfortunately, you're going to have to keep track of all that sort of stuff. And plan uh, around that. 